Anything I can help you with? Into the ship builder again. Sure. How about it? And this is really just the default frontier. Um ship builder B. Cool. Ship builder allows you to fully design, modify, and paint your ship. The floor gauge to the right tells you where new modules will appear when the floor gauge is at zero for example and new modules will be placed on the center mass of the ship okay building new ship modules will cost credits and deleting them will give you credits back the ship builder but will keep a running total and process the entire transaction at the end there is a flight check that will give you warnings or errors in your design if your design is invalid for any reason cool yeah now i can ban and fully move so let's modify the existing um frontier i guess what we're gonna do is select maybe all the top level stuff first so like this 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 um this, 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 mm. is that kind of all of it? Looks like it. Okay, and we'll move all of this to the side. Let's put it on this side. Does that sound? Okay, cool. Now, this is a Nova Galactic Frontier 2x1 uh, passenger slots. I think we can take off the reactor as well with this cargo. And then we'll take off these as well. can go there so this is the landing bay I can start by removing this and we'll start adding so how do we say options left control um no add G uh, so we got shields we got structural Nice, a lot of structural stuff. We can go through them maybe at some point. That looks really cool, right? This wing. Nova wing. Gee. Flip. Maybe we can do something with those, but for now, we need some um, bays. Not bays. Dockers. Not dockers, no. Engines, fuel tanks, gear, grab drives, tabs. This is what we want. So, this is a storeroom. This is an all in one. This is an engineering bay. So I'm thinking we do the... What's this one? Galactic. Nova Galactic Frontier. It's the default. So let's... Add one of each. Mm, oh, that's the storeroom. Okay, cool. That makes sense. So we might delete this. Storeroom. Delete... Then we'll add an all-in-one berth. We'll also add a engineering bay. So that might come at the bottom. So we'll add the engineering bay on top. 
Okay, now we already have a lot of extras. And then we can see what else. Oops, back. Uh, one by one, full room. Companion way. What's the difference? I don't see it. Companion way. Oh, now I see the all-in-one berth has more specific things. Oh, the variants. Okay, that's pretty cool. So let's redo these then. Let's re-add them. So for this, we want... Control station, crew stations, or workshop. I, yeah, which one? I don't know. Workshop. Yes. And then for this one, yeah, there is only one option. Companion way, storeroom, companion way, yeah, car, boom, for the cargo I might actually add, different one, weapons, base, cargo, I think I have one of these in ballast car gold here. Yeah. This is crazy. Looking pretty good actually. What happens if I move these like here? No? Well, I guess let's put the top on and then we'll see how it looks. So we'll put all these pieces on. This, 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 this. Like that. Oops. Wait. I didn't select everything, so it's easier just to redo it like this. Yeah, so I can go here or here. I can go there. That's fine. Then we'll move this out a little bit that oh, this these wings in there um 
and we'll move this up and we'll add a third yeah let's add a third um tab here these demos ones are really cool actually they look really cool yeah one by one storeroom companion way I don't know if it's necessary. Nice. Cool. It's a bit bulky. I think we need to make one last major change, then we're good. I'm going to move this stuff out in that I'm going to remove this we don't need it then I'll do that and Okay, we're just going to leave it like this for now. An upgraded frontier. Ooh, it's a bit crappy, but we'll fix it over time. Let's see what it looks like. It's going to cost 5,832. Flight check. Oh, there's one warning. Or add engines to improve mobility. Oh, interesting. So these are the engines. White Dwarf 2000, so maybe we can swap them out for something. Add engines. I think for the for the engines, let's get some structural stuff I'm looking for a wing a wing of some sort I don't know I'm looking for a way to do a, a wing Let me start at the top here. I think it's structural. Maybe it's this bracer. Maybe. So, what does the bracer do? The bracer can do this. But. I want a different one. So let's see. Are there like cool wings maybe? Not really. Nova wing. Yeah, let's do this.
And then we'll add two more engines. Let this boom. New engines. Engine. Dwarf. 2000. We got those. Let's go with these. They're not too bad, actually. What happened there? Oh. Can't attach it to the wing thing, but we'll see. Maybe we should do this. I still think I should get a wing. Oh, this thing needs two connection points. What do we need for this? It's a Nova 1000 engine. the right wing with the okay those engines are nice uh structural let me move out the way here so I have some space so I'm pretty sure I've seen like a wing of some sort before Weapon mount. this thing was supposed to go though that look that's a bit of a weird one I just need a better bracer 
or I'll resort to just sticking with the swing or throw. This was meant to be used together somehow. ship by now. be reactor then as well mm. but I need piloting rank three so I won't be able to so I won't be able to use these either so I'm guessing gonna do some engines extra add engine well structural Two of these. This might work well. two on the sides here now so 
Magazin. Nice. You got it. I think it might work. No. Emo Grav Jump. Okay, so need to upgrade the Grav Jump. Grav Drive is a bit low. Add Grav Drive. So this one's a 160. It's this one basically. 8, 13, 52, 5. This Vanguard one's really good. We'll add that, sell this, and flight check. All systems good. I'll keep it the frontier name. Um, close and exit. Confirm modification. Enter. Accept. Nice. So that's a whole modification. Bit of a few kinks here and there, and we can build off of this. It looks a bit weird, but it's gonna be cool. So let's try it out. Thank you, dude. So my ooh, it's um, it's big. It looks good. Nice. Yeah, that up top there is really dumb, but we'll fix that at some point. A lot of space though. Hey, let's go inside. Check it out. Mm. Cool. Now we dock into what is the all-in-one, I think. I think you can modify some of this stuff, right? Um, I might change it for something that actually has workbenches. So yeah, that doesn't have any workbenches at all. Then you continue through to the cockpit, basically. Through this way, but yeah, then we can go up. We'll change this all in one berth. Not that great. Ladder, we go up. And this is the storage I think or the companion way then we built an engineering bay here which is really cool because it's got a weapon workbench it's got an industrial workbench it's got a spacesuit workbench nice some seating up here is just a companion way oh this is where i got down okay so this way let's pick it out yeah that's just a companion way i think and then over here is oh that's the hatch cool but we'll add some more cool habs. And we can... Yeah, nothing to do here. We can try it out real quick. Take it into the base.
take off. Not the prettiest ship. It looks a bit pregnant, actually, to be honest. Cool, so... No, it looks good. <laughs> that bump down there. That's why I said it looks a bit pregnant. Yeah. No, it's this middle part that's the issue. that's the target locking that I added but yeah the ship looks just all right for now it's just a little bit more practical than it was so yeah some basic guide I guess to modifying the frontier 